In this video, I'm going to get you up and running with CodingBat, a website we'll be using to help us build our programming skills. CodingBat was created by Nick Parlante from Stanford, and it provides valuable practice opportunities for students in both Java and Python. To use CodingBat, you will need an account. Simply visit the site and provide the requested information. Make sure to share your account with my email so that I can track your progress and give you credit for all your hard work. Allow me to demonstrate. Go to the Coding Bat website and create an account using the last comma first name naming convention. Then click create account. Before proceeding, we need to go to our account settings. So click on preps and then under account settings, you'll see a setting called teacher share. Take a moment to share to the email address I have provided you and then click share. Afterwards, it should show a sharing success message. CodingBat is straightforward and easy to use. Simply click on the problem I assigned you, read the requirements, and then fill in the function or method body until you have successfully completed the challenge. This is what it looks like. Start by finding the problem I assign you, and then read it very closely. When you're ready, complete the method or function body with the code that satisfies the requirements. Since we're dealing with functions and methods, your solution should involve a return of some kind. When you click go, it runs your code. Fix mistakes and revise until your code satisfies all the test cases. Provided you log in, your account will keep track of all the problems you've solved. And from my end, I can see the problems you have completed, so there's nothing else to submit to me. Happy practicing.